after a fairly decent, but ultimately anticlimactic unbreakable, and an amazing showcase of James McAvoy's acting abilities in Split. Glass turned out to be an extremely disappointing waste of potential. As there's nearly nothing in the end product that we feel is worth salvaging, we are going to fix this movie in a future what it could have been video. So here are the steps we took to develop this Square One rewrite. Step 1. Make it more like Split and less like Unbreakable. The superhero references were okay for Unbreakable, but they were taken to painfully unsuccessful New Heights in Glass. The movie should have built off the groundwork established in Split rather than dismantle it and hastily reassemble it into Unbreakable 2. Step 2. Don't throw out everything the first two movies worked so hard to establish. Unbreakable spent the entire film establishing that David was special. Split spent the entire film establishing that Kevin was special. So why did Glass spend nearly the entire film telling the audiences that they're not special? This was an even great waste of time considering that you already know the third act is just going to establish yet again that they are all special. Step 3. Don't include the mental hospital or the secret organization. This is essential when applying steps 1 and 2. Step 4. Don't use characters unnecessarily. While it's great to see Casey in this film, her depiction is completely unrealistic. No one who went through what she did in Split would ever volunteer to go talk to, and even hug, her kidnapper. If they wanted to include her in this movie, it should have been done more organically. Step 5. Write a story that takes advantage of the incredible star power in this movie. We have three terrific actors in this film. Samuel L. Jackson spent at least a third of the time pretending to be drugged. Bruce Willis spent most of the movie reciting the fact that he needed to be released. And James McAvoy spent most of the movie as Hedwig. He's a great character, but McAvoy already proved in Split that he can do so much more. Step 6. Give each character a clear motivation and character arc. When we watch this movie, we need to know what each character is trying to achieve, what their goals are. The three of them all have such ambiguous objectives and they spend so much of the movie in a state of flux that it's impossible to root for any of them. And no matter who your favorite character is, you're going to be disappointed by the time the credits roll. If they had clear goals that they achieved, then even if they died, we'd still feel like their characters' stories were meaningful. Thank you for watching. If you have a movie you would like to see fixed, please leave it in the comments below. If you'd like to see more, subscribe to my channel or visit qjmartin.org.